Clip Town is one year older than Soweto. Declared as a town in 1903. Today it's a home to plus minus 45,000 people without uh, a number of basic things such as electricity, running water is communal, bathrooms are communal, and no schools. My name is Tulani Matondo. I'm the co-founder and executive director of the Clipton Youth Program that is located at the Clipton Informal Settlement. Growing up in Clipton was very challenging for me, just like it could be for many young people around the community, because at times you feel like you don't have control over your life because you're just being faced by challenges day in and out. The Clipton Youth Program was founded as a response to the social challenges in our community. The main focus of the Clipton Youth Program is in education, to help children with their homeworks and to help them to do better at school so that they can be able to change their life situations within their respective families. KYP offers five programs which includes the homework assistance program that runs every Mondays to Thursdays for about two hours a day. It's the feeding program where we provide two meals a day. Right now we are preparing the sandwich that kids will come and take them in the morning. It's their breakfast and then some they can eat on their way to school. But when they come back from school, they get a hot meal prepared for them. We also have computer literacy, sports program, as well as the performing arts. KYP, we're very lucky to have uh, a library. We don't want our students to always be behind, so that's why we try our level best to ensure that we've got a textbook for almost every subject that the students are doing, especially in high school. Through our existence within the community, a lot of children have access to opportunities that we don't think they would have if we never had a program like KYP. So storage devices are devices used to store data or information. In our Performance Arts program, that's a program that we also pride ourselves very much with because it has played a huge role in terms of our fundraising. Since we started our program, over 50 young people have traveled the world, which is something that has never happened within their respective families. My name is Kolofelo Mekwe. I'm from Town. I used to attend here when I was doing my trek. They managed to get good teachers so that they can come with the after-school programs to assist us. And after that, KYP, they gave us an opportunity to register at uh, tertiary institutions. So they paid for all the fees there, and I was there for a period of three years. Over the last 10 years, our organization has been very successful in ensuring that uh, over 30 young people have graduated from universities as well as colleges. What I would love to see with the future of this community is firstly people with basic things such as schools, running water in their homes, electricity and people not living in shacks. And I do believe that that will happen as long as we educate as many kids as we can. These are South African heroes.